picked up the spook today. The little Gary Yamamoto thing looks pretty bad, so hopefully you can catch me some fish. All right, guys, I'm gonna try something different today. Came down to the lake, I got about two, three hours max. Um, I'm gonna do a little challenge. I'm gonna do best three fish bag, top water only. So I got a frog and a spook. I'm just bringing two poles and a scale. So I'm gonna see if I can get like a 10 pound bag with three fish, that would be really cool. But who knows, I might only catch one fish, but we'll see. I'm going for three, best three fish bag. So we'll see what I can do. All right, we already got two issues. Number one, I walked over there, took like three casts of the frog, it broke. Walked all the way back, retied a different one. Came all the way back here, took a cast with a spook. The spook was not really working. It was just diving under and kind of going all over the place and wouldn't go just like side to side. So I just spent five minutes trying to fix that and that wouldn't work. So I have to go get my old spook now. So I just wasted about 15 minutes by the time I get back there. So I just wanted to let you guys know it's not starting well. But yeah, I'm gonna get fishing within like five minutes. So hopefully I can catch some. I even told myself I was gonna catch the first bite I got, but he missed it, but I still shouldn't have set the hook. I was kinda not expecting a bite, just reaction. Dang it. Let's see if he'll bite it again. I didn't hook him. Oh, I got him that time. Decent fish. Oh yeah. This will help me out. First fish, if he stays hooked on the three fish bag, see if he get over two pounds. I think he is over two. Oh, yeah, I won't spit it. I got this one. Come on, stay hooked. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's a two pounder. He'll help me out. Fish number one out of, out of the three pound bag. See what he does for me. First fish in about 45 minutes, it's been a while. Not much action. Let's see what we got here. Scale's not very accurate, but it'll still, it's in the ballpark, I'm guessing. 1.98, two pounder on the dot. Put that in my notes, fish number one. It'll help. Cute, epic slow-mo release. He missed it. I always do that. So I, like the, there's a sun reflection, so I, I couldn't see if he had it or not, so I just set it, but he missed it completely. That was probably three or four pounder, if you guys didn't see. All right, guys, I got a plan. I'm gonna finish up this little section, hopefully get another fish or two. And then once the sun sets a little bit more, go to the rock pile and throw top water around that. Hopefully the seagulls don't go nuts over the spooks and stuff. We'll see. I just missed what would have been my kicker but I'd rather miss him than lose him because they'll bite again eventually. And that was a good fish, but I, he like he missed it, so that's why I missed him. But I'm gonna keep fishing. There's one, got him. Decent one, not a big one. Couple casts after I missed the big one, I moved down a little bit. Stuck this guy, I think I got him good. He's, I might have to call this one once I get, if I get two more, or two more fish. Yeah, he's not big, I'm gonna weigh him. Probably one and a quarter, maybe a half, I don't know. But still, still a fish. It works, take anything. Frog fish are always fun. Uh, 1.47, 1. 1. that's what it was at, before he flopped. So one and a half pounder on the frog. Fish number two. Let it go. Here she goes.
Oh my god, no! That was insane! I had him hooked too. <laughs> that was the coolest bite I've ever had. I don't care if I miss it or not. <coughs> oh my god. He came like a foot and a half, two feet out of water. Oh my god. Gotta love spooks. Hey, last spot. The, the sun's just setting right now, so I don't have a ton of time. But I'm gonna frog like this, these weeds right here. I always catch them along here. And throw the spook along there. There's a ton of seagulls, so hopefully I can spook them before I start throwing the spook. But we'll see what I can do. Need one more fish to complete the bag. Oh, I had it too. Look how shallow it is right here where we just had it. It's literally up to like right here. I was looking behind me. And I was just gonna rip it out of the water and right when I ripped it, he hit it. It's literally like three inches deep right there and there's a drop off out past the weeds. So I don't know what he was doing following up. That was a good one. I hooked him. I don't know how he came off. I am fit this this spot's pretty good I think. Last night fish he had like three bites and really quick and then seagulls had to get ruined the fun, but all the seagulls just flew away. For, oh, most of them, I should say. So hopefully I can get a few before they come back. Oh, right on shore. Oh my God, it's a good one. Oh my God, what the heck? Look how shallow it is where he hit it. He hit it right here and I'm walking right towards him. Look at this. Oh, that's a good fish too. That's gonna help me. It's not huge. Jeez. Alright, I got my three, so now I gotta try to call my 1.47. <laughs> you guys yelling at our said good job. He's pushing two, so I need a kicker now. Now that I just got him, I'm feeling it. I'm gonna catch some good fish over here. Oh yeah, two, 2.05, biggest fish today. Fish number three, so now we gotta call that one and a half pounder. So yeah, I might run out of daylight. Let's see if we can get a couple more before it gets too dark. Oh, I missed it, dang it. Oh, I got him again. Oh my God, there's so many fish over here, guys. Well, that's definitely gonna call that one point. That 1.5 is decent. Two fish on two casts. Haven't even started moving that much. Oh, that's a good one. Wow, this is fun. Jeez, you're tugger. I was just one in. It's just felt. Yeah, that's gonna help for sure. That's another two pounder. Okay, get a quick weight. I gotta go fast because we're, we're very low on time right now. I have a feeling I can catch like a ton of them right now on, in, within like 15 minutes. I'm not even gonna go fish the other rock pile. I'm just gonna stay here. 1.87, that's gonna call that 1.4. All right, let her go. Oh, what's big in? Get over here. Oh, that's a good fish, I think. No! Why do they always come off? That fish hit it right on the rocks, too. Did you see that blow off? I had him, I set the hook so hard. Jeez, I hate that. It happens so much to me. All right, so I did things a little bit different today. I decided to do like a little mini challenge. Top water only, before it got dark, best three fish bag. I ended up catching four fish. I called one fish that was one and a half pounds. I ended up with 5.9 pounds on the dot. It's not very good, but it's better than nothing. I, I, I filled the limit, so I don't know what's going on with the spook. Like I'm getting the bites that I, I want to get, but I'm not landing like the big ones like I'm, that I want to land. But it's better to get the bites and miss them than not get the bites at all. So at least I'm getting those, but 
yeah, I don't know what's going on. I'm still trying to figure it out. But I mean, tomorrow, I'm going to try something different. You'll see. It's going to be interesting. I don't know how it's going to go. But, yeah, I'm going to try that. So stay tuned. Like and subscribe for more, guys.